screen. The HTC U11 Life has a smaller, lower resolution screen than the U11. However, it's a punchy display that, in most conditions, doesn't look much worse than any phone out there. It's a 5.2 inch 1080 x 1920 Super LCD. There's not too much brightness loss at an angle, and color is well saturated without looking overdone. The image also appears very close to the top surface, a sign of an advanced super thin screen architecture. You have to take the HTC U11 life into a more extreme environment to see its limits. We're not talking bare growls fodder, just that you'll see very slightly raised blacks in a darkened room, and the brightness is bright but not quite the 1000 nits of the brightest. That said, we took the phone out on a fairly bright day and the screen was still clearly visible. HTC's website claims there's a feature that lets you customize the display color profile, but it's not in the software of our model. Battery Life The HTC U11 Life has a 2,600 mAh battery, smaller than those of the Moto G5 S Plus, the Honor 9 or the Moto X4. Thanks to the energy improvements of the Snapdragon 630 chipset, stamina is just about acceptable. However, on busier phone days when we've streamed a few hours of podcasts over 4G, the HTC U11 Life needed to top up hours before bedtime. If you want a phone that lasts through a day, almost, no matter what you subject it to, the HTC U11 Life isn't the best choice. Results in our usual battery benchmark or poor 2. A 90-minute video played at maximum brightness takes 35% off the battery level. The Moto X4 lost just 